Hello everyone, this is your love reading and we are going to find out together with you at your time when you found this video is your time. You and me and Taro are going to look into your relationship and um, Taro is going to give you advice according to what will happen next in your relationship, how they feel about you. This card tells me that they're not moving anywhere. They're not going forward with the relationship. They're not doing anything. They're just waiting for something to, to happen. They're not taking any steps. They wait for you to take steps. They are um, uncertain what to do next. Something is stopping them. Something is stopping them from, from any action. They're just looking around and um, waiting for something. Indecisive. You can call it indecisive. How do they feel about you? Actually, it's a good card. It tells me that they do love you. Two major arcana. For sure, they are interested in developing a relationship with you. They're interested in anything that happened with, between you. They probably miss you if you are having right now um, a relationship that is a uh, distant. You and your loved one are not not seeing each other in person. So maybe uh, you're FaceTiming, maybe you're Skyping each other or Zooming, um, maybe you're in different countries, different continents. Uh, so um, you are not able to see each other. Something stops you, some situation. Is it a world situation? like we all find ourselves right now uh, that is stopping you from seeing each other or it's just a family situation but they are really interested to continue your relationship because they're two major arcanas ten of swords um, this card tells me that there might be other forces that are involved. There might be people or circumstances that stops you from seeing each other. Maybe there was misunderstanding between you. Maybe you quarreled. Maybe you misunderstood them. They misunderstood you. Um, they are waiting to understand more what you really you want from this relationship. But the love is very deep. There is love in the heart. Love is very deep. It's a true love. However, the wound, the heart is um, wounded. The wound is too, too painful. It hurts. Both of you are hurt in this relationship for some reason. Maybe you lived together and something went wrong. It wasn't easy. It was not easy. Day-to-day -day life was not easy. You were not settled. Maybe there were financial problems. Eight of Cups tells me that the love is strong, but the past is hurtful. The past is um, something that divides you. There is will to be together. There is uh, also longing to be together, but the past is really hurtful. Maybe some other people were involved, maybe um, some rumors about um, you or them um, 
misunderstanding, maybe fear, fear of not being hurt. Um, you were trying to explain yourself and um, they understood it completely wrong. Um, but um, Five of Swords tells me that there is um, some spots in a relationship from the past that must be healed. That, that you and them must to come to terms. You must talk. You must see each other and talk. Um, there will be a um, good solution. Nine of Pentacles talks about you probably will come together again. They will look for you, they'll search you, they'll find you. Um, you might also try to find them, to find the way to them. Maybe write them a message, maybe try to meet somehow, because um, they are they are also missing you. You are missing them and they are missing you. Um, oh yeah, there's a lot in the past that must be healed, but there is um, love deep within heart and uh, the universe will give you another chance. There will be um, something new development in your relationship, deeper connection, deeper understanding each other and um, something that is more than just boards, something that is more just um, deeper joy, joy of being together. You already had this joy before in the past and now is the time to revive it to give them another chance. Because you see lots of pentacles. Because this time when you come together and start to build an, a new beginning for both of you, there will be more joy, there will be more understanding, there will be um, better circumstances. And um, that will create a space for both of you, a safe space to express your love and save space to love and to trust again and to find to find ways to communicate better the joys of love it's a physical love it's a true true beginning and deeper deeper feelings that were building up even at the time that you were far from each other inside of their heart and inside of your heart the the love is there and it um, it it became um, like like flower opening up you know so um, the king of cups tells me that the heart is ready for a new beginning with you the lover's card is well here so not only the heart is ready the whole being is ready for a new beginning uh, universe is giving you a second chance and um, all these cards you know all this sequence tells me that um, maybe very unexpectedly you will just bump into each other and conversation starts and um, both of you will express uh, the feelings and uh, might uh, both of you might be so happy to see each other that you will um, start to date again to date each other slowly slowly don't rush things don't rush it it will be slowly this time slowly but sure because last time it was bum it was fast and full of troubles, full of heated emotions. At this time, it will be slow, but sure, uh, going to going to go into right direction, into a direction of trust, slowly building up relationships, slowly um, building up that trust that is needed. 
and slowly molding it into each other. That's what will happen next. I see the good future into your relationship. It's a nice uh, reading for you. Um, let me know in comments how is it for you and I will see you again. Bye-bye.